direction. down from here first. I can't make the chain reach that far. I can't put it there.
what am I supposed to do with this? Maybe we'll think of something. Sophia? Yes? See you soon. Don't leave me here, Indy. Are you sure this is safe? Hurry up! And let you drop this bronze door on me? Just trust me. Not if you're going to yell. What makes you think this is safer now? I've got a plan. Which is? Brace the cage with a hinge pin. You know, that just might work. There! You know, I had to slug you. Come on, Sophia, don't be angry. Angry? You left me rotting in this hellhole! Well, if that's how you feel, maybe you should stay here. Maybe I will. Great idea. Fine. Fine. What was that? Sure, I think Nurab Sol made me do it. Is that so? Dangerous fella, that Mr. Sal. Yeah. Well, we better be going. Indy, Nurab Sal is here. I sense his presence. Hold on a minute. 
Are you feeling okay? Never better. I feel... All-powerful! Then you get rid of Kerner when he finds us. He doesn't scare me! Oh, for crying out loud. In here, Indy. Follow me. Ah, oh, Dr. Jones. Welcome to my humble abode. Sophia. Big portal! Jeez, this place gives me the creeps. Oh, I find it exceptionally restful. Yeah, the stone beds sure look comfy. Silence, fool! Come on, Sophia, let's get out of here. Never! I'm staying right here with the spirit who guides my thoughts. Sophia, is that you? The woman that was is now the king that shall ever be. Address me accordingly, please. So are you a girl or a guy now or what? Flesh means nothing. I am the Great Spirit Incarnate! Yeah, well, I'm glad we cleared that up. Why are you acting like this? Acting like what? Speak your mind, Carl! Come on, Sophia, get a grip on yourself. I am no longer the one you called Sophia. I am simply the one who rules! Mind if I look at your necklace? Ah! Ow! That medallion is hot! Drop it, why don't you? Perhaps Sal won't let me. I bet this one never won a beauty contest. Look at those feet, or whatever they were. It's a huge version of the Microtar statue. Atlantean graffiti.
Going up? I'll wait down here. Suit yourself. I don't think that'll work. I'm not going back there. I'll wait for you here. I'm not going back there. I'll wait for you here. Chance again. Too bad you didn't leave when you had the chance. Don't be too sure. Whoops, wrong turn. Come back and fight like a man.
Aha. I don't think that'll work. Now that looks much better. More or a calcum beads. I can't pick that up. Dr. Jones, you got away before, but not this time. Don't you know when to quit? Whoops, wrong turn. Run, you coward! Jones, Jones, you never learn. We'll see about that. Maybe I'd better head north. Come back and fight like a man.
wonder if these markings are related to that huge machine. like another hungry mouth. It's a lever. On board, Sophia. lever won't move. This lever won't move. That was close. Too close. Stick 
close, Kate. This could be dangerous. I'll take my chances. Reach it. I can't reach it.
here's your shining city. Not what I expected, that's for sure. And the place is still humming, maintaining the air pressure for untold centuries. That didn't do anything. Still nothing. Uh-oh. What did you do now, Wimpy? I think I turned it on. You see, Colonel? I told you Jones would be of some use to us. Kerner, I knew I smelled a rat. All I smell. Congratulations, Dr. Jones. You've just handed the Sir Craig its ultimate victory. It'll take more than a few orichalcum bombs to conquer the world, Norman. Bombs? The gods don't need bombs. Take a look around. What do you think this astonishing machinery was used for? Well, that's a mystery we'll never unravel. As Plato itself well knew, this was a factory for manufacturing higher beings! While you've been wandering around, we've been stockpiling oricalcum. But now we have all we need! Are you ready for the greatest moment in history, Doctor? Did you notice all those hideously deformed? Experiments gonna die, unworthy slaves sacrificed in the name of knowledge, progress has its price, you know. Maybe they weren't quite human to begin with. Inhuman or subhuman, they were destroyed by their physical imperfections when they gazed at the awesome power of this device. Unfortunately, we suffer from no such imperfection. I think the heat in here has cooked your cabbages. Scientific discoveries belong to the bull, Jones. That's something you of all people should understand. This machine still works? Why not? Everything else we found here certainly does. Think of it. As a god, I shall know everything. Be everywhere. Rule everyone. We both shall rule here, Doctor. Eh? Don't be silly, Colonel. You're not prepared for this. We shall see. Godhood sounds good. I like a crack at that. I like a 
them back this courage. No! What? If anyone's going to become a god, it must be me. You? Don't make me laugh. I am in charge of this operation, you spineless sausage. Activate the machine. <sighs> a test is a test. Plato suggested 10 b Let's try that. Wait. What now, Charles? Oh, go ahead. You could use some self -improvement. You sound a little too happy about this. Tell me what's so amusing. I think Plato prescribed an oracalcum overdose. Hmm. Just a thought. You may be right. They should divide by ten. Try one bead. One bead is it. Himmel! It's parking! A small bead for a small man, eh, Charles? Now it's your turn! And no thanks. God hoods for egomaniacs like you. No! Unless you want my men to move you! That's better! What makes you think you can outdo the old kings? Science, my boy! We have it and say did it! Here goes! Hang on a second! Let's talk this over. No time! How many beads should be used? No beads, you crazy old man. Come now, Doctor. There's your scientific curiosity. Listen, what if Plato's error went the other way? How do you mean? I think Plato and Kerner were both wrong. All right, George, you decide. How many feet should be used? No beads. Forget your stupid obsession. Really, Dr. George, get the grip on yourself! Okay, let's get it over with. Is your mind composed? Anger or resentment may spoil your chances! No, forget it. Calm down, man! For your sake, I hope this doesn't work. Why not? Once I'm a guy, I'm sending you straight to hell. I'm offering you immortality! Is that the thanks I get? Ever hear the term angry god? Wait till you see me. Hang on! Perhaps I haven't thought this through! You want to go fast! 
discoveries seem like tall tales even to me. At least there's some evidence this time. Then again, maybe not. What was that for? To ease the pain. Thank you. 
Uh -oh. What did you do now, Wimpy? I think I turned it on. You see, Colonel? I told you Chorns would be of some use to us. Kerner, I knew I smelled a rat. Dr. Jones, you've just handed the Sir Reich its ultimate victory! It'll take more than a few orichalcum bombs to conquer the world, Uberman. Bombs? The gods don't need bombs. Take a look around. What do you think this astonishing machinery was used for? Wait! 
What now, Charles? Oh, go ahead. You could use some self -improvement. You sound a little too happy about this. Tell me what's so amusing. Ten beads may give you size ten antlers. Hmm. Just a thought. Maybe right. We should divide by ten. Try one bead. Ten bead it is. Himmel, it's parking. Position yourself! Match me! That's better! Here goes! Hang on a second! Listen, what if Plato's error went the other way? How do you mean? Dividing by 10 didn't work, but multiplying by 10. Alright, George, you decide. How many beads should be used? A hundred beads. Shoot the works. Let's hope you've picked the correct amount. Thank you.